if there's one issue that's really important at the general election this Thursday, it's the NHS and particularly uh, what's going on at Warrington Hospital uh, right here in our town. Warrington Hospital, as I revealed last week, has got a £15 million deficit on David Cameron's watch. Many of you will know from your own experiences uh, that NHS services in Warrington are really struggling. They're in a bad way at the moment. Lots of people can't get a GP appointment when they need one. We've lost our walk-in centre in Warrington. And Warrington Hospital, despite the fantastic efforts of all the staff there, is really struggling. Uh, we've got uh, long waiting times for operations and operations being cancelled. We've got some of the worst A&E waiting times in the country. Ambul ambulances waiting outside uh, to drop off patients. Uh, things are in a bad state. And why is that? It's because David Cameron has broken his promises on the NHS. Before the last general election, David Cameron promised the country that they could trust him and his Tory government with the NHS, but he's blown it. He's broken his promises and our NHS is really struggling and staff and patients are, are suffering as a result. So I think there's lots of reasons, good positive reasons, to vote Labour this Thursday. But above all, I think it's important to vote Labour to save our NHS. It's in a bad way under the Tories and only the Labour Party has got a credible, fully costed plan to rescue the NHS and give it the investment it needs. We're going to put more taxes on the tobacco companies and the hedge funds and we're also going to introduce a mansion tax. So we're going to ask people who are lucky enough to live in houses worth more than £2 million to pay a bit more into the pot every year, specifically to fund thousands more nurses and doctors and midwives in our NHS. So I really would say to you, vote Labour this Thursday to, to save the NHS, to sort out the mess at Warrington Hospital and to make sure that NHS staff and patients are treated with fairness and respect in the future. I really hope to have your vote this Thursday and if you want to learn more about Labour and about my campaign here in Warrington South please visit our website www.warringtonsouth.org. Thank you.